for the first time is a live action Star Wars series. It takes place about five years after the return of the Jedi. The series follows a Mandalorian. This new character is a gunfighter, a bounty hunter, a citizen of the underworld on the outer reaches of the galaxy. It starts off with him just hunting down quarries, making his money. This is a character you've never met before, in a period of time that you've never seen. There's just an aesthetic to the Mandalorian that is extremely powerful, mysterious. This armor that harkens to medieval knights. He's relatable. We're all kind of covered in our own armor. Here we are, day three. Just start a little bit back and then we would in terms of the directors, I think John shows the team really, really well. Here we go! Obviously Dave, Bryce, Deborah, Rick, and then Taika. And there's the different voices and personalities that each of the filmmakers were bringing to the table and wanted to bring that to the world of Star Wars. Everybody's point of view is sort of involved in the story. The series offers the opportunity to introduce new planets, new races and species, new starships. However, we wanted to feel completely connected and familiar. It's truly an adventure, a Star Wars adventure. It has the heart that Star Wars has always been about. It will feel gritty, it will feel real. But anybody could sit down in their seat and watch and enjoy. 